And this is here, you're passing the city. If you're here, you're going to know. I'll catch you up with you now. Why don't you help the woman get into the lorry? Yes, sir. Hello, Adi. How are you, my friend? Good. Now you too. Not bad. Only yes, life is getting check, tougher check, and tougher here in Accra. <laughs> I'm going to Kukuran to me, you know. Oh, I see. Take this. Give it to my brother, you see. We have to finish our family house. Hmm. He can use this to buy cement. Okay. What else should I tell him? Oh, say I'm okay. Although times are a bit rough now. <laughs> hey, uh, oh. Anyway, be frank. How many watches have you stolen? Get today? off me! Look, I have never stolen a watch in my life. I'm not a thief. I'm a businessman. Oh yes, Kobe. Everyone knows you are a businessman. Everybody is a businessman in Accra today. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So from where do you get your watches? Oh, from America, Japan, London, Switzerland, Germany, Lagos, from, from everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> Let's pray this guy take a safe trip back to the Grand Jimmy. With these horrible bricks. Look, get inside the lorry. We are leaving now. All right. Okay, Kofi. Bye bye. Okay, bye bye. Look at these ties, Kofi. I have complained to Alaji several times, but he just wouldn't care. Oh, leave me alone with your Alaji. Look, he's a crook. Why don't you leave his lorry to him and come to Accra like me? You'll be a free man. No Alaji to bother you anymore. Coffee. I'll see you eh? <laughs> okay. Bye bye. Right. Yes. Tick tock, tick tock, cheap watches. Yes, yes. Tick tock, tick tock. Cheap watches. Hey, wait. Yes, yes. I'm Mary, what do you want? I'm going to Kukran to me. My mother is ill. Hey, you guys, go to the bank. The hey. golden seat is for the beautiful girls. Huh. What's wrong with you? Eh? Are you getting crazy? Okay, hold on. Now, who is the crazy one here now? Huh? Oh. <laughs> you ashamed to say that to me? The club is closed now. Immediately after the revolution, the manager ran away to Agege. A lot of the girls have been arrested. Why don't you come back to the hmm? I'd rather die than go back to live in that village. told me that most rich men in Accra have only one wife. The rich men have got many wives, just as our chiefs. No. Look, every man can have as many wives as he likes. I will also have many wives and children when I am rich. Bob. Yes. Mm. Promise me that you would marry me, only me. I promise, only you, no second, no third, no fourth wife, okay, Amina. Stop it, Bob. I have to meet my father at the lorry station. Your father, your father, always your father. Why don't you ask him if we can ever get married? Do you know what he'll say? Bob, what are you? You're a palm wine tapper. I'm not giving my daughter to a poor man like you. Ah, you are stupid. Your father thinks he's something special just because he dies a lorry. If you don't ask him, you'll never know what he'll say. And if he says no? If he says no, we'll go away from here. If he says no, we'll go to a class. 
And how are you going to live in Accra? Mary, you have to tell me so much about Okay, all right, I will. Oh, Mary, it's a long time. Yeah. I hope tonight you will buy us a petition. Okay, I will. <laughs> Abuna. Abuna. Yeah. All right, I'll see you later. Hello, how are you? I am fine. I'm always happy when you come from Accra. Your son, Kwesi, always sends you big, big parcels. <laughs> he must be a Kalabule master in Accra. <laughs> My son has sent me toilet paper. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck to your pass, then. Be thankful you don't have any. I have. Everybody has. I don't. <laughs> oh, you mean you've never wiped your ass? Sure, I did, but I didn't get it. I'm stronger than all of you. <laughs> What they were singing, they don't go see them and cheat them anymore. But me, they want to cheat me. What type of government just lay down first and such low ones too? That is the revolution. What did you say? I said that is the revolution. I see. All right, Adi. I want to tell you something. Me too. I don't go see them and cheat me anymore. I was paying you 600 CDs a month. As from now, you are going to get only 500. But you can't do that, you know. It wouldn't be fair if you do that. <laughs> not fair. It is your revolution which is not fair. You can't complain to me. Go and tell them. Now get out from here before I sack you. I say get out. Dambaza. Yes, sir. You ask Al Haji for the new tiles, and he threw you out. <laughs> oh, be honest, I heard him shouting. You are wrong, Boafu. He was shouting about the revolution. Oh, is that all? Then don't mind him. Thank you. Are you cool, Adi? Your brother Kufi said you should buy cement with this for the family house. It seems Kofi is doing well in Accra. <laughs> you don't 
don't know. Kofi went to Inzima to make Juju with his penis. <laughs> <laughs> you can make Juju, you get rich. Or smuggle, call a nut. Like a rag. So, they will catch up with him one of these days. They can't touch a hard. He has borrowed all of them. But with the revolution, it's not so easy anymore. I hope so. Bye-bye. Ah, I'm going. All right, boss. Good evening, Mr. Ali. Hello, Bob. Uh, I'll bring the grass for the sheep later, but um, if you've got some time now, I'd like to discuss something with you, Mr. Ali. What's the problem, Bob? Uh, uh, Mr. Ade, uh, yes. uh, as you know, I'm a, I'm a palm wine tapper and I'm sending the wine to the bar. Okay. Afterwards, you'll bring the grass for the sheep. Okay. Bye-bye. Okay, Bob. Okay, Bob. Just bring the grass for the sheep, Bob. But keep away from my daughter. I need some more money to buy rice. I brought you some from Accra. That was a week ago. You must cut down a bit. Things are hard these days. You are the only one in this house who eats rice. Abnai and I have been eating fufu all the time. I must also buy some meat tomorrow. You can kill a chicken. The few chickens left are reserved for Christmas. Why don't you want to give me money? But I bring you enough from Accra. Everything else you get from the farm. You don't need money. Must get married. She's in love with Bob. Have you never noticed? I'm away all day. Bob is a good man. He brings grass for the sheep every evening. You know that. You can't get a wife with grass. Your ideal husband for your daughter cannot be found here in Kukren to me. Bob and Abna love each other. Maybe. Not maybe, Adi. That's how it is. Yes, Akra. Akra Yes, Akra. Two man. Right.
Mary, yeah. let me also be nice. Bob will like it. Yeah. <laughs> it might attract him to follow me to Accra. It may even encourage him to ask my father if we can get married. It's not easy talking to your father. Do you think he'll accept Bob? If not, I've told Bob we'll just go to Accra. But Abna, why do you want to go there? Life in Accra is hard. But you still live there. You don't know how I live, what I do, how I, I earn the money you admire so much. You don't know how often I sit alone in my room and cry and would give anything to be back in Kukuntumi. Working on the farm and sitting with the boys by the river in the evening. Of course, I know what you do. And if you married one of them, you'd live in a big house. <laughs> oh, it's nice. I'm not marrying any man just because he's rich. Why not? You sleep with them for money. That's different. How? Will you marry a man you don't love? No. There, you see? I want to marry Bob. What if there were no Bob? But there is. What if there went? Oh, stop it. <laughs> now later they don't want one and before you know it you won't have any left you don't have to give one to anyone <laughs> oh, that's what you think they should get their own anyone who smokes will give you a cigarette if you ask her okay you keep your cigarette but that's not honest either oh Abna, you have a lot to learn <laughs> A minute. That's a friend of mine from Kibi. Hi, Mary. Hello. Can you come with your friend to the restaurant tomorrow morning? Okay, I'll see. Was he your friend? I'll tell you later, okay? What a born man is the born Yoko! <laughs>
Hold it. Are you injured? Whoa, what happened? What happened, Master Hiding? The bricks. The bricks again. Oh, these bricks. Are you injured? Are you injured? Are you okay now? Are you all right? Thanks be to God. Yes, Mesa Shop. That is. And you know he has been cheating us always. You see why I say you are drunk? Every day you go to that and one bar to drink. Shut up, you drunkard. Give me my keys. You think we Muslims are crazy when we avoid alcohol? But I never drink when I drive a large. I say, give me my keys and get out of this house. I suck you. Shake it, Parao. Didn't you didn't give me my pin? So what are you going to do now? Have we ever gone home with that palm wine after getting back from my drive? Let's go. Let's go. I See, I like you much better without a lorry. <laughs> Look, do you think I'm going to be a farmer again? Oh, but there's nothing else you can do. I'm a driver. The best driver I did. <laughs> hey, Ofori. I think you said you will give him money to buy you a watch from Accra. Do you have a lorry, my friend? <laughs> <laughs> Look at Daddy. He hasn't got a lorry anymore and wants to bring me a watch from Accra. I will go to Accra myself, Adi. Shall I bring you something? Bring him a lorry. They <laughs> gave them to me for you, Bob. Mm. Thank you. I've got to smoke more now. Just imagine the other faces when they see you smoke a cigarette. Here. Maybe later. No, now. Bob, please. I said later. Okay then, give them to me. I'll smoke them myself. <laughs> this is Mary Kim here. You've been completely crazy. I'm not going to the river bank if you don't smoke. You think you can always command me just like your father? Huh? Wait! Wait, I'm gonna wait. Just leave me alone. Smoke your cigarette yourself, big lady. <laughs> Will you talk to my father today? No, 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 not today. Why not? I must wait for the right moment. I told you I would speak to him. Yes, but when? Wait and see. When I talk to your father, to be a man-to-man -man talk. It must be well planned. A man-to-man -man talk. <laughs> I can't just go to him and say, Hello, Mr. Ade. Uh, we are getting married. No. Today is your last opportunity. You're a coward, Bob. I'm what? A coward.
Pack this as well. What are you going to do with it, Addy? Put it in. I'll take it along. You can't do that. Who else is going to protect me in Accra? He wants to sell it. I know he does. But he has no more money. What else can he do? This will bring bad luck to the house. I don't believe in this juju anymore. It belonged to Addis' father. It has always protected us. Abuna. Sit down. Abuna, you are a big girl now. It's time we get you a husband. Your mother tells me you are running after Bob. Is that true? Bob, this foolish boy. Your mother says he's a fine boy. She says that just because he brings us grass for the sheep in the evening. He didn't come yesterday. Maybe he will come today. We are waiting for him. Ah, oh, Papa. Never mind, Abna. A girl like you will always find a husband. I don't want to leave you, Sarah. But maybe I've got more luck in another world. Don't go. Stay with us. Kent, I'm a driver. The people will laugh at me now if I go back to farming. Very soon, the accident will be forgotten. Then you can live here like everybody else. I can't. I can't. I can't stay here. Hello, Mr. Adi. I've come to ask for your daughter's hand in marriage. I want to talk to you about her, brother. I've come to ask you for your daughter's hand in marriage. I want to talk to you about her, brother. Mr. Adi. Mm. Look, I have no time. I want to talk to you about her, brother. Talk to her, blind yourself. Goodbye, Mr. Adi. Hello, Menza. Hello, Adi. What can I do for you? Well, I'm looking for work. And I thought I could work here. I'm a good fitter, you know. Don't you work for Haji anymore? No. Why? Well, no. you know our roads nowadays are full of potholes. The, the, the brakes failed me, and the front axle got broken on my way to Accra. I see. So Al Haji sacked you. The swine. He didn't even pay me for this month. And so you think he can work for me? Well, it would be a great help. I'm sorry, Adi. I've got enough fitters. I'm not like Al Haji. I can't sack any of them. And as you know, we sometimes even play football. There is very little work and no spare parts. What about this lorry? Oh, it's a lot of scrap. Hey. Look, with a few thousand cities, you can put this lorry back on the road again. Hmm. It's not worth it. 
I only keep it for spare parts. I know. But if you give me the chance, I'll repay it and you have a new lorry. There is no point. What you need is a new job. Just let me try. Okay. I'll give the lorry for a special <gasps> price on credit. But you have to pay, find money and pay for the spare parts. Just with the semen, sir. This lorry will soon be back on the streets of Accra. Uh, But you said you'd go with me. I've never slept with a man before. Oh, Look, you won't enjoy it, but that's not the point. In one day, you can make more money than your father does in a whole month. You can go home if you like. Hello, lady. Don't disappoint me, Abna. Hello, I'm waiting for you. Hello? Taking the meat out of my mouth, are they? Oh, I'm sorry, Kofi. I've been looking for you everywhere, and the door was open. I'm not working today. I sold three watches yesterday. So I'm staying home today. Tick tock, tick tock, cheap watches, cheap watches. Tick tock, tick tock. Look, am I a monkey to go on doing this play every day? I've got something better for you than this monkey play. You. You wait and see, Kofi. Okay, Adi. Do you know what I think about Mesa and your lorry? 
Bullshit. Ade? Bullshit. You see more and more buses in Accra today. They are quicker. I prefer to travel by bus more than by lorry. Look, the days of lorries are over. Traffic will break down altogether without lorries. Look, in a few years, we'll make a lot of money with a lorry. And where are you going to get the money for the repairs? You could sell your watches. Look, I have the lorry. You have your watches. If you sell them, I mean, sell them at the same time, look, we'll make a lot of money. Then we'll buy the spare parts. Then we'll be partners. <laughs> And how am I going to live without watches? From the lorry, of course. But how old is Mrs. Lorry? If we are lucky, 30 years, maybe 50. Yes, we can repair it and put it on the road again. And it will break down every second day. No, I cannot risk my watches for that. Don't worry, Kofi. I'll find another friend to help me. You are worrying yourself too much. Look, you will never be a rich man. Just like me, we will never be rich. I'm going to get that lorry on the road again. You are crazy. <laughs> All right, Ade. You are my friend. I'll help you. I know a bit about lorries too, but I am not selling my watches. Please get that idea out of your mind. All right? Yes. Tick tock, tick tock, yes. Cheap watches. Yes. Tick tock, tick tock. Yes, yes. Tick tock, tick tock, yes. Cheap watches. Take all the watches away from my room, eh? Kofi, oh, officer, this is my friend. What has he done? You will see your friend for a long time. This time he's going to prison. Oh. Poor Kofi. They've got him this time. It's a pity. Oh, my new master is in. We must be going now. Goodbye, Master Adi. Goodbye, Abuafu. And good luck. Thank you. Nana, you have been a great help to my family from generation to generation. Now, I've brought you to Accra. Give me good fortune today and let me sell these watches without any trouble. Destroy all my enemies and open my way clear in my struggle in Accra. Here is a drink for you. This will be enough for the spare parts. And I'll give you the lorry with special price and on credit. How about your friend, Kofi? Will he be happy that you sold all his watches? 
When he comes back from prison, we'll be partners. He can't deal in watches anymore, or he'll be arrested again. Have you already got a buyer? Uh, I, I thought... Uh, I'm sorry, Adif, but I don't buy stolen watches. I only thought you had connections and knew people who can help me. Sure, I've got connections, but I can't offer them stolen watches. I'm sorry. Okay, Adi. I'll try. Thank you, Mesa. Thank you. Leave the watches. They are safer here. Thank you. You like her, don't you? You don't have a good taste for women. Show me a prettier girl, and I'll give you a hundred cities right now. No problem. This is my daughter, Abna. You've won. <laughs> <laughs> if I didn't know you, I'll throw you and your watches out straight away. Well, I haven't got time now. Bye bye. No time to die. <laughs> Thank you, Mesa. But you don't owe me anything. Bye bye. Bye bye. How do you like it? Ah, beautiful. to me so fast. My lorry takes two hours more. Oh, we have to stop. I think there is a funeral going on. It is one of our old men in town who has died. They say he died of a heart attack. I hope our brother does not get one when she sees me. Never. <laughs> you have a big repair shop in a beautiful house in Accra. Every woman will want you to be a husband. Thank you. 
Menza, I want a grandchild like this. <laughs> Is that her? She's more beautiful than the picture. Don't worry. He's a good man. I'm going to marry Bob. Abna, I'm very fond of Bob too. Bob is not a man. He's just a boy. A fine boy. I'm going to marry Bob. Mensah will take you to Accra. He has a big house there. Oh, he has got television. You asked Bob to look after me and Mama when you went away. That means you promised me to Bob. You just can't come with another man and ask me to marry him. Talk to Mensah first. Have a look at him. Maybe you like him more than Bob when you know him better. That big belly man, I don't even want to see his face. You have a lot of happiness with him, Abena. You need a man who can feed you. A man you can rely on. He's a rich man. He would have more wives later. Bob will never marry another woman. That is what every man says. Thank you. You stay in your room until you come to your senses. Mensa, you know you are my friend. What is going on? Abna ran away. She will come back. No, she won't, Adi. I asked you if you've talked to her. You've tricked me, Adi. You've lied to me. Mensa. Oh, shut up. She will come back when it's dark. I promise you. I don't want a woman who is forced to marry me. Abna will not get a better husband than him. Abna loves Bob. You knew that, Adi. Bob is only a Pamwan Tapa. Yes. And what are you? I have my own lorry now. You understand? Lorry. All with Mensa's help. He won't help you anymore. What are you going to do now? I'll go back to Accra. Are you taking us with you? Later. to Accra. Somebody will take us. And then, Abuna, what then? We'll go and see Mary. I'm sure she'll be able to help us. Mary? Of course. Who else? Should I go back and marry the Fatima? Oh, Bob, the car is stopping.
Let me get you some more beer. Okay. Very well, Helpers, you'll see. I can't throw you out. Thank you, Mary. But I don't want any problems with my landlord. He's already annoyed. <laughs> Since the revolution, I've been paying only half the rent. <laughs> <laughs> Abna, you can't stay here. He can't say anything against a girl. But you, Bob, I'm afraid you have to go and look for another place. I hope you understand. I can't help it. Okay, I understand, Mary. Abra, let's go. Wait, well, for what? Mary, I thought you were my friend. All right, you both can stay. Thank you, Thank Mary. You. <laughs> but Abra, you can't be wearing such things in Accra. Let me get you some clothes. We'll find our own place soon. Do you know how many people are looking for a place in Accra? Thank well, I'll you. Get a job. What can you do, Bob? I can read and write. Oh, <laughs> then good luck. <laughs> Welcome to Accra. Hey, you. Hey, you Adi. The keys. It's not my fault that my daughter ran away. The keys. Look, Mensa, I would like to see you married to Abna. The keys, or he pay for the lawyer immediately. No way. The keys! Uh, uh, is, is that how you are? Yes, that's how I am. We agree that I'll pay back the loan when I made enough money. If you don't pay, I'll let the police arrest you. This is my lawyer! It's not yours! Never let me see you again, you bastard! Our lorry. You'll never go to prison again. How did you do it? <laughs> My work, your watches, and Mensa gave me a loan. My watches? Yes. That was all my life, you bastard. My life. Look, Kofi, you cannot sell watches again. Who knows how long you'll be in prison next time? Come on. Cheer up. Eh? Look here. <laughs> <coughs> here. It's good. Don't drink. No, only palm wine. <laughs> How much did you get for the watches? All of the spare parts. Who bought them? Minson organized it for me. You could have got a whole lorry from those watches. What? And he has threatened to seize the lorry if I don't pay back the loan. Look, come. come let, let's go to Mensa. No, it's too late. He cheated you. No time to die. He thought you could do a quick deal to get rich, eh? <laughs> but Mensa cheated you. All you saw was the money, that's all. I was also thinking of you. That's nice of you. By the way, who's the driver and who's the mate? Uh, I thought we could share the profits, eh? <laughs> you can do whatever you like with your mess. Please drive me home. We can talk later. Okay, don't be. <laughs> oh. You were really not joking. My watches are gone. 
Do you know what you have done to me? You are a crazy dog, even more crazy than me. How can you sell my watches without my knowledge? Next time, you may even use my wife as you have done to my watches. Pack your things and leave this room. But go on to you if you don't bring my share of the daily account. Are you serious? I said back and leave. Get out! Job anywhere, I'll earn about 25 cities at the most. At the most, Bob, at the most. Some people even earn less. Okay, Mary, but how much did you just give to the boy? 50 cities isn't enough for three beers. But a lot of people drink in Accra. How do they find money for it? I don't know. Somehow they manage. Those who can't afford it have to drink water. Oh, there are no important people here. <laughs> and where do they find the money from? Money, Bob, money, money. What is money? Look, after the revolution, when the 50 CD notes became invalid, the sea was full of money. There were 50 CD notes floating about everywhere. And Everybody laughed when they saw all the money in the sea. Yes, I heard it on the radio that the market mummies have thrown them into the sea. I was lucky, thank God. I got a hint two days earlier from a friend of mine who knew somebody up there. I quickly changed all my 50 CD notes. <laughs> you have to have connections when you are in a cry, you know? Otherwise, you'll be lost. Ah, forget it. Excuse me, what kind of work do you do? We have factory hand work, store work, and labor work. Okay, thank you. Hello, Bob. 
Why are you looking so sad? No luck today again? Bob! Most of the people there have been waiting for over three months. Don't worry, Paul. Hey, how are you, Mary? Oh, hello. Excuse me, just a minute. Okay. Are you... I'll get a job. What kind of job? I'll get a lot of money. Come on, tell me what kind of work it is. I'm going to work in the bar. Just serve drinks and talk to the customers. Mary knows the manager. You're not going to work in a bar. Bob, we need the money. Then let's go back to Kukran to me. No. What do you mean by no? I'll never go back to Kukran to me. Then tell me where in Accra I can find a job. You shouldn't give up. One day you'll find a job. In the meantime, I'm going to work with Mary in the bar. I'm doing it for us, Bob. Are you getting crazy? I want my own home. I want to clothes. I don't want to borrow any more, Mary. Come with me to Kukran to me if you really love me. No, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Are you coming with me? No, leave me. I'm fed up with you. I don't want to see. Hey, what all this noise for? Get out of here. <laughs> hey, are you crazy? What is wrong with you? Get out of this house. Foolish man. Stop it, Bob. Stop it. What's the matter with you? I don't want to lose my room. Wait, Mr. Adi. What is it, Bob? Abuna is my wife. Papa, he's lying. He just slapped me. Is that true? What? Yes. Your daughter is a prostitute. What did you say? Abena, you can't get any work here to do in Accra. You see, Mary is a prostitute, and her life is already spoiled. If you stay here, you are going to be the same. You better go back home to Kurang to me. Look, I have to struggle hard here to take care of you and your mother. Abena, go back home and help your mother on the farm. Farm? I like to stay here and struggle for myself. After all, you wanted me to come to Accra. Look, Abuna, all I said was, you know. I'm sorry. Abuna! 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 Here, take this. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going back to Kukran to me. Look, don't go. Stay here with me. I know a lot of people. I can help you. This T-shirt is torn. Let me get you another one. I think this will fit you. Thank you, Mary. 
But I can't stay here. I must go back. Okay. Let me put on something. Then I'll take you to the station. Okay. Turn round. It's not my fault that Abna has gone away. No, it's not your fault. Hello. You have to pay for entrance if you are not a member. How much? 100 CD. 100 CD? Yeah. I'm sorry. Hello, good lady. Are you alone? Do you have time? I want to know if you can give me a lift too. Okay, let's go. Let's go. I'm taking you home. I'm not going to my father. No. What's up, Mama Sarah? you some food. Thank you, Mama Sewa. Now let me enjoy your food. I wouldn't know what to do without you. How is it going with you? Fine. I've been able to buy 50 palm trees and I'm now building my own palm wine bar. Hey, that's great, Bob. going to look after it for you. Uh, that is my problem. I wish Abna were here. Have you heard anything from Mr. Adi? No. Maybe Mr. Adi will come back. I'm not waiting for him. If you wait, you never live. Well. Please don't forget to bring the grass for the sheep. And uh, don't forget my bowl. I've been going along this evening, Mama Sewa.
Hi. Hi. Go and feed my sister boss. Aren't you ready yet? For just a minute. Well, how'd you like it? Great. Great. That's for you, sweetie. Thank you, Mr. Bye bye. Bye bye. bye, -bye. That's what I always wanted. Relaxing at the beach. And every evening a nice guy comes by with a load of money. <laughs> How's life? It's all right. Is that all? What about this? Look, look. That's more money. Look, my friend. No tricks, eh? No tricks! Take good care of the lorry. We need the money. Wait a minute, Mr. Driver. If you search it for your daughter, you can find her in Mrs. Bed. Why did you tell him his daughter is living with Mensa? He must know. He's annoyed, and he won't bring the money anymore. Look, the lorry belongs to Mensa and me. Yes, but you don't work. You just collect. Look, do you want me to play Boafu for Adi? No thanks. I can do without these few cities more. Good evening, Mr. Adi. Mr. Mesa is there. Throw her out. Then I'll go myself. Neither you nor Mesa can stop me. It is your house, but she is my daughter. Come on now. Mesa is not a good man. Why not? He helped you with the lorry and he gave me lots of clothes. I think you better go now, Adi. Throw him out, Mesa. 